answers everything you need to know to place objective. The game that will keep you guessing. Let's unbox. Every game comes with subject cards, secret word cards, a card stand, point tokens, dry erase markers, and an instruction sheet. Setup is super simple. Just pop out the point tokens and hand out the markers. Oh, and get ready to get creative. Whatever that looks like. When you're ready to play, choose someone to be the guesser for the first round. The player to the left of the guesser draws a secret word card and chooses one word. That will be the secret word. They then find the matching subject card and write the word on the back, propping it up in the card stand so the guesser can see the category. Everyone else should see the secret word. When everyone is ready, the guesser says, Subjective! Then it's a scramble to find the subject cards you want. There's everything from food and drink to famous people. It's first come, first serve. So there is a chance you might not get the subject you want. Here's where you need to get creative. Everyone writes their clues on the back of their cards and places them down, subject side up. What makes the perfect clue? Well, that's subjective. It helps to use your knowledge of the other players. Try to customize your clue for the guesser. Next, it's time for the guesser to guess the secret word. The guesser chooses which card they want to reveal first and flips it over. They then make their guess. If they're wrong, they choose another subject card and make another guess. When they get it right, everyone cheers! The guesser and the clue giver both score a point. But wait! Don't erase the other clues just yet! After the guesser gets the secret word, there are still points to be had. The guesser's goal now is to guess the rest of the clues written on the subject cards, one at a time. Reveal each one as they guess. If the guesser is correct, the guesser and the clue giver each score a point. Once every clue has been revealed and the points have been awarded, the player to the left of the guesser becomes the guesser and the next turn begins. Continue playing for two to three rounds depending on how many players you have. The player with the most points at the end wins. And that's how you play Subjective from Spin Master Games.